एक बड़े असुर में तेरी गली में खड़ा है दम है तो आ नीचे You guys have such a big cast with so many big names. Is that a good thing for you guys, or do you sometimes feel like you know egos get in the way, different opinions? How do you feel about that? I'm happy to be here <laughs> <laughs> uh, with you know the whole casting crew here. It's absolutely a dream come true. Sunny, this is not gonna work. We need to kind of create some. You know, I can't stand you. You can't stand me. I can't stand I can't you. Leave. She was actually yeah. wearing, I was wearing the same dress. Yeah, and like, like we can't wearing. stand each other and like there's a I major like ego clash and you know, like that. Two hot women going at it, let's do it. I'm no. feeling this. Uh, no, the men have to that. work what? on the, <laughs> they work on the egos and they control it. Women just let it out. <laughs> Sorry, are you telling me there was no squabbling on set? You guys weren't bickering over anything? I, I was the, the cribber because, uh, you know, the song without me, as I said, uh, you know, so. Manoj and me were not involved in the song, so that was the only ego clash which we had. Yes. <coughs> yeah, yeah. We were very upset John with John and Tushar and, and, and Siddhant and... Uh, well, I read somewhere that you were quite jealous because yeah, you know, the... Because of, uh, yeah, because you see the thing is, uh, very jealous, not very jealous, I was very jealous because I wanted to do performance with Sophie, with uh, Priyanka and with uh, Sunny and, and of course Kangana also, he's got quite a few love making scenes also with Sunny. <laughs> <laughs> Over to John. Don't try to hide from this. <laughs> well, I also was very jealous and uh, bitter because I was kicked out of a song because I wasn't available at a stipulated oh. time. And uh, yeah, ala re ala. So yeah, we've all, I think each one has his own issues, but none of the issues are kept inside. I can voice it because I love the song and. Um, I'll be jealous on my life, I guess. Now, you two, I, I do have a question directed at uh, both Anil and John. You're you portraying real characters. This is uh, obviously a movie based on a true story. What does it feel like? Did you meet any people um, who've encountered these characters? How do you feel that they might actually be watching the movie? Well, I, you know, the, the, the character which my character is based, of course I met him. I spoke to him, spent some time with him, and, uh, and met his family also. And he's been of great support and uh, quite helpful. And it really helped and it was great to do a real life character. But unfortunately we had to change uh, his name, uh, so it was, now it's Afaq Bagra, which is good in a way because I feel uh, somewhere, uh, you know, because it is somewhere a hybrid of fiction and fact. So, you know, so except for Mania Surve and uh, and Munir's character, uh, basically Tushar and uh, John, the rest all of us uh, characters have been somewhere, they have been fictionalized. So uh, that's what, where we are, and it was fun doing this film, and it was great doing this film. I was a little bit of a surprise to me. My name is Mania Surve. I was a surprise to me. उस दिन तक बॉम्बे पुलिस के हाथ कायदे और दायरे ने बांध रखे थे मैंने वो हाथ खोल दिए ये कहानी उस पहले पुलिस इनकाउंटर की है this guy led a very interesting life. He ruled Bombay for four years and he had 12 confidants around him, but no one knew where he lived and he used to operate alone. And uh, the only person who knew where he lived and gave him away was the woman he loved. So, uh, it's uh, there's a tragic love story that's beautiful. Uh, the characters are beautiful. His best friend's amazing in this film that's played by Tushar, who actually helps him get out of jail. So I think uh, uh, there's a lot of respect that he has for the guy who finally kills him in the encounter. And there's a lot of respect between the two in their own domains. That's Afaq Bagran's character and mine. Uh, he tries to get into a gang that's ruled by uh, Zubair and uh, it's, it's uh, you know, how he encounters him, how he meets him, how he meets his mistress there and how he finally, his rise happens where he 
has this lovely item song so everything is beautiful and it was an experience playing this I was watching the trailer there's no way we can't mention this John your run that like slow motion Baywatch run, you know, the, sh the shirt off. Is that something you guys enjoyed? Is that intimidating? What is that like all the time? Just the... It wasn't on the beach. <laughs> and, uh, in fact, uh, it's a documented fact in the film where this guy was actually training when his best friend was being um, beaten up somewhere. So what we've shown is actually factual. There was no intent to show the body. And I think uh, we've tried to steer clear of the physicality as much as possible and concentrate on on performances and I, I'm sure that'll come through.